Okay, this is Jenny Gonzalez with Keller Williams Corona. And I, today I'm going to be talking about 341 Wylehorn Drive. Thank you, Mark. And that's in Crestline, California. It's 2,100 square feet. And that's by an appraiser, lot size 7140. It's a three bedroom, three bath for 350. My name is Jenny Gonzalez. My license number is 0124. 9788. My cell phone number is 951-316-0374. And my email is there as well. I've been a full-time realtor for 21 years and I'm proud to serve as always. This is a way I'm trying to get my listings sold because I know that this market um, is still a hopping market and there's still people out there that need homes. Now this one is a rental and it's always been a rental, but it can, for, if you want to live in it, you're more than welcome to live in it. I know that there are people up there that just love to just have it as a second home and then rent out during the season. It's completely up to you. There's two units plus an extra unit, or you convert it to a single family residence by just removing some walls, okay? So I'm gonna go through the property again for you. So here are some pictures I took this weekend, and I hope that they explain a lot about the house. And if you have any questions, please just give me a call or go ahead and heck, go ahead and do it in the uh, Facebook Live right there. Hi, Matt. How's it going? Okay, so here's the front of the house, and she started doing all. She I think she did most of the railings. She just need to paint some of the house. There's four parking spaces at this property. Two are on the deck and there's two on the street. Most of the properties around here don't have any parking whatsoever. So this is very unique. And again, there's three units. It's a two bedroom, one bath and a one bedroom, one bath and then what we call a man cave. So there's two kitchens, a kitchenette. There's three bedrooms, three bathrooms. And they're all rented out on a month to month basis. So if you buy the property, you can keep the renters or whatever you want to do. Here are some pictures I wanted to um, show you. This house on the, on the right over here, when we were up there, the kids were out playing on the balcony, they were playing music and they were having a great old time. They seem like great neighbors. This is going down. I wanna show as many pictures as possible so you can see how good a condition the property's in. Again, if you have any questions, go ahead and ask. Here's one of the entrances and one of the units here. You can see the views. Here's looking up. Here's the front of the property. Here's a view of the mountains from up top. Again, if you have any questions, go ahead and ask. Now here's going down to one of the other entrances and here's one of the balconies. There's a balcony that actually wraps, the balconies wrap all the way around the property. So there's a 360 view. And here's down below where we were at when I was taking pictures. And this goes all the way up to the top from the bottom. Here's a look at the back of the property. It's in good condition, it's multi-level. Some more pictures. Here's a view of the street from down below. One of my favorite things about this property is actually this here. I would love to be able to sit out in the mountains on a couch, on a chair, listening to the crickets and just enjoying the night. It looks like there's been several people that have been doing that as well. And here's the living room in the main unit. And like I said, you remove walls, you've got a single family residence. You don't remove the walls, you have three units. This is the main unit. It's got a freestanding fireplace and it's a nice little room. Yes, that's the old TV back there. We drove a couple of doors down and I just took this picture. This is how close that we are to the lake here. It's actually a two or three minute drive and I'll get to that a little bit later. 
for 350, you guys, 2,100 square feet for 350. Three bedrooms, two baths. There's two kitchens and a kitchenette. Here's the main kitchen. This is taken from the appraiser. This is as well. So I'm just giving you an idea of what the units look like. Here's the main unit and the fire, gas fireplace there. Nice big living room there. Here's a few of the bedrooms. Here's one when it's furnished. I like that actually. The closets are nice and big. How beautiful is this? Great job. Look at this is the middle unit. One of the bathrooms. Now forgive me for the toilet seats when we get to the toilets. Here's a second kitchen. You put your fridge over there and some cabinets. And this is the um, kitchenette and the man cave. This is the second bath bathroom. And forgive the toilet seat. And some more pictures of the bedrooms. Bathroom, toilet seat up. Now this is the common laundry area. Everybody uses this. There's actually a door. Everybody can kind of go and do their laundry and it's nice and clean. I'm glad they keep it nice and clean. Now here's where we drove about two or three minutes. We drove down and we, saw, we sat and we ate lunch by the lake. People were fishing, people were hiking. We actually went and hiked as well. And people were fishing. It was really beautiful. It was only a two or three minute drive from here. And here's where the house is located. It's right near the lake, Lake Gregory. And here's another one. Hi, Wax and Corona, how you doing? So I will go through this again. And I'm gonna wait for any questions first, and then we'll go through the property again. Okay, so I'm ready to go through this again. I see a couple of people on. So this is my listing up in the San Bernardino Mountains. It's near Lake Gregory. It's 341 Weilerhorn Drive in Crestline, California in San Bernardino County. It's a 2100 square foot home on a 7100 square foot lot. It's got three bedrooms and three bathrooms for 350. It is currently three units. It's got a two bedroom, one bath, a one bedroom, one bath, and then it's got what we call a man cave with a bathroom and a kitchenette. You can convert it back to a single family residence by just removing walls. Here's the front of the house. They did start doing the painting on all the rails and everything as much as they could before the rain started coming. Here is two parking spaces out of the four for this property. Usually someone might have one space, if that. This has four parking spaces. So there's two on the deck and two in the street. Now I'll show you some outside pictures we just took the other day while it was beautiful out there. I can see how the railings are. You can see how their balconies wrap around all over. There's a 360 degree view with regards to these balconies and these uh, views. As you can see, I tried to take as many pictures with as many views as possible. The house is on a down slope, so there's the upper deck and you're going down to the house. And here's a view from one of the decks, one of the doors. Here's a view going up. You can tell they just painted that. Another view of the slope going down to the house. 
And here's our mountain view. I love this view. And I want to show you some more wraparounds and some more um, areas with the balconies and the units. Here's one of the balconies here. If you have any questions, let me know. Here's down um, on the property. We were down taking pictures, and this is part of the lot. The stairs going all the way up. Now here's the back of the property. You can see it's multi-level. It's in very good condition. If you have any questions, go ahead and ask. Another view of the property. On the side, and there's our neighbor. Here's a view of the property going up. There's the parking right up there. And what would you want to do at night? Listen to the crickets. Sit and listen to the crickets, the birds, and enjoy your evening. Here's a living room with a freestanding fireplace. This is what it looks like furnished. This is an appraiser picture. And this is just a couple of doors down. This is a view of the lake from just a couple of doors down. This is the main kitchen. Again, it's a appraiser picture. I wanted to use as much as possible. And another kitchen view. Here is a living room fireplace. Very large living room. Gas fireplace. Any questions, go ahead and ask. Bedroom pictures, nice and clean. Here's one with it furnished. Nice big closet. Here's a second kitchen. I broke things yesterday. Uh, here's one of the bathrooms. Here's the second kitchen, nice and clean. Just add your fridge. This is a kitchenette in the man cave. Second bathroom. Nice and clean, sorry about the toilet. Here are some bedroom pictures. This is from the cellar. The ones timestamped are from the actual appraiser, but these are timestamped. Um, appraisal here. So some of the bedrooms from about a year and a half ago. I uh, forget the toilet seats. Here's that one of the bathrooms. And here's the common laundry. So everybody can use the laundry. Here's a picture. We went and drove about two or three minutes down to Lake Gregory and we had lunch. People were fishing, people were hiking, people had their dogs. Uh, we sat and ate our lunch. It was beautiful. Right now, it's gotta be beautiful with that snow coming down. I wanna show the relation to the lake. Here's the house, here's Lake Gregory. And here's another view here. Does anybody have any questions?